You know, the producers at Northwest Arkansas Alive have had me doing some crazy stuff lately. Whitewater kayaking, had to be a ninja once, roller derby, rock climbing. So this is a treat from them back to me. This is the cave, men's grooming and lounge, an unbelievable place if you need a trim and need to relax. We're in Rogers, Arkansas, and if you haven't heard of it, here's a sneak peek. All right, Krista Pacheco, the owner of The Cave, thank you for having us yeah. into your wonderful business. I'd love yeah. to get some information and a little history behind the, the store. So where did the idea come from? So really we got the idea from our clients and what they were looking for um, in a barber shop. And a lot of our clients are from out of state and so they had different experiences in different states that Arkansas just didn't have yet. And so we just wanted to kind of bring some of that into the area. So you were 22 years old when you decided to open the cave. Right. And people love a, a local success story. You're a local girl. At 22 years of age, you decided to, to give this concept a try. It was at a different location. Right. But tell me about the journey and the adventure and the roller coaster ride it's been since you opened it up to now your new location and where we're at today. Yeah, so our original location was a studio that had two chairs in it, and a lot of the girls worked in there with me, so we all just kind of shared the chairs and worked when we could. We were really thankful that our clients kind of stuck out through that phase because it was not pretty in there. But we were there for two years while working on this, and then I actually brought on one of my clients as a business partner, and eight months after that, we opened here. A lot of our clients, they feel really connected to it because once again, they've followed us. Some of my clients have followed me. This is the third location that they've they've been with me and they've been my clients for six years. And so it's a good feeling for them too to walk in here and be like, you know, glad we stuck through it and right. dealt with the tiny space that we had before. But also I see obviously a chess table. I see a place for merchandise. I see a flat screen TV. There could be some sports on there at some yep. point. So while you're waiting or even afterward, this is a place to pop out the laptop, you know, maybe even meet with a client and just yeah. hang out in the cave. Yeah, I mean, really, we try to push to come here to get away from work, but we definitely have guys that come in and do work here. We've had several clients bring clients of theirs in here as well for services. Often we'll have guys come in 30 minutes before their appointment and we'll be like, oh, you're early. And they're like, no, I know, I just want to hang out for a little bit. Right. And they'll just make themselves comfortable on the couch and they'll get a shot of whiskey or a beer and hang out for 30 minutes before their appointment. So as we talked about earlier, they've been putting me through a bunch of stuff. I'm ready to have the relaxing, yeah. upscale experience. You, you ready? Yeah. All right, let's, let's go. All right, so we're back in the stylist area. And I can, yep. right off the bat, I can tell you this isn't your average barber chair. Right, so I actually like to say that these are custom made because the place we got them from did not make them in this color. And so they oh. had this chair, but it's not in this color. So we like to say they're custom it's chairs. It's technically and definitely custom yeah. made then. And they're very comfortable. Speaking of custom, so this stylist station, you know, this was custom made, you were telling me, and just, you can see the attention to detail as you look around. Everything in here that is wood, so the stations, the bar up front, the sign, and the front desk was all done by a friend of mine, Keith Lennox, and he actually did this at his house in his garage. That is unbelievable. Yeah. So your friend's helping you with the woodwork. Yep. Your mother works at the front. Yep. Dude, this is like a family affair. Yeah. yeah. I love it. That's a lot, of, take a lot of pride in there. I do. All right, so let's get trimmed up. Yeah, go ahead and okay. have a seat. Well, it's more than just a shave or a haircut or a shoe shine. It's the hot towels, it's the atmosphere, it's the personalities, it's the local feel, it's the cave. And if you haven't been here to experience it, come down to Rogers, Arkansas and check it out. Thanks so much for having yeah, us. Yeah, you're welcome. All right.